okay now let's see this and then interpret the data given we're going to start by first plotting the graph now the experiment has been done and then these are the values or the results obtained here we plot our graph by putting the y-axis volume of co2 on the y-axis and then time on the x-axis so when time is zero volume is zero so this is the point we are going to plot that when time is 10 volume is 20 between 0 and 20 there is a midpoint that is where our 10 is and then this will be where 10 is when the time is 10 the volume is 20 when the time is 20 the volume is 35 so here the midpoint between 20 and 40 is 30 32 34 and that is 35 each small line is worth two okay when the line when the time is 30 we have 47 so here is 42 44 46 47 when the time is 40 we have 56 so 40 here is 50 52 54 56 right here when the time is 50 we have 64 so 62 64 each small line is worth 2 when the time is 60 69 so 60 68 is over here and 69 will be in between that we go on to 70 73 so here is our 70 72 73 at 80 the volume is 77 so 80 volume is 77 at 90 volume is 79 at 100 volume is 80 at 110 seconds volume is still 80 so now we've plotted our points the next thing we do is that we draw a line to pass through all those points okay the line should be finer than what i am drawing mm -hmm. so we draw a line to pass through all those points and then we are done with our graph